Oh, well, Anthony will be able to charm the pans out of her. Oh, thank you. With his collection of metalware. So I have seen Karen on the show. She looks a very nice lady to me. I'd like to get as much as possible. I'm hoping around about the fifty pound mark. I might have to weigh things up a bit carefully on the next deal. Well, you're looking very dapper. Oh, thank you. <laughs> what have you bought me today? I bought you some scales that used to belong to my mum. Mm -hmm. They used to be highly polished when she had them. You've been slacking? Yes, well, this is why I brought them in, because they should go to a better home. They've been looked after and nurtured in the past. Yeah. But they are very much out of date and very neglected. Yeah. Were these your mum's as well? Not the big trade. Someone gave that to me. Has somebody got a tipple going here? Oh, a little drop. Little drop. <laughs> Are you a whiskey fan? I've always got a little spot. Yeah. Oh. Well, these two items here, they're Johnny Walker advertising, aren't they? Yes. Um, and we often come across, like Guinness, we often come across Johnny Walker. Yes. I mean, he's got his stick and his top hat. And these are copper, aren't they, these two items? Yes. Johnny Walker whiskey, um, it was Kilmarnock originally. That's where it was distilled. And then in about, I think it was 2012, uh, they closed the, the Kilmarnock factory down, much to the dismay of the locals. And I think it was moved. But it is the widest distributed brand in the world. Yes, if you see the old films, it's usually a Dr. Johnny Walker, where Sydney Green Street or Humphrey Bogart were having a drop. Well spotted, Anthony. Mm. And the scales, very faintly, we've got a little bit of advertising going on there. Well, that was the makers. Yeah. It's the real McCoy, and I'm sorry to see them go, but my good lady doesn't like cleaning brass, as you can see, and yeah. neither do I. Yeah, I was going to say, what about you? <laughs> mm. But the important thing is, all the weights are there. Everything's together. I'm very impressed. I'm very happy about that. Yeah? Yes. Let's see how rich I am, then. Put the, make sure the handle goes the handle's in as well. Handle's in, Anthony. Let's see how good you are at guessing weights. That's two pounds and eight ounces. Oh yes, spot on, well done you. Done that a few times, haven't you? Two pounds, eight <laughs> ounces. Is that how much yes, I'm worth? Two what... pounds, eight. <laughs> <laughs> well, obviously these have been superseded by digital scales, but there's people that like Kitchenalia advertising, there's yes. people that like social history. So, you know, we're covering several markets here. Um, it's not going to be a fortune. I'm sure not. It's not, and I wish it was, because you're so lovely and I'd love to give you lots of money, but I'll put some money down and we'll see where we go. <laughs> right, you ready for this then, Anthony? 20, 40, one more dip. There's 50 pounds on the table. What do you think, Anthony? I think you're very generous, but... I was hoping for something a bit more. Well, yeah. Yes. If David's around, we'll grab him and see what see what they reckon it, shall we? Oh, David? Yes. Good Lord. Would you like to meet David? Are you serious? I'm serious. <laughs> he hangs around the show occasionally. Anthony, how are you? Please sit down, sir. Look at the I'm pleased to meet you, I'm too. pleased to meet you. The first thing that caught my eye was the Johnny Walker tray, which takes me back to a boy when I was about... 12, and I used to run home from school at about 3.30, and Granny Emson, who I used to live with, had about 60 pieces of brass or, and copper around her kitchen. One of them was the Johnny Walker tray, and we used to sit there. I was there till 9 o'clock at night, polishing all that stuff for Granny. So. I could have used you then. Absolutely. The estimate on these items is 30 to 50 pounds. We are dealing with a highly professional, tough dealer here. But something has touched her heart today. I wonder what. Straight in with 50 pounds. I understand they're worth a great deal more than that in sentimental value. But I think she's done you proud. Pick the money up. Well done. Thank you very much, Mr. David. Well, I think that speaks for it all, is not it? Yes. Hey, it's worth yeah. 50 pounds to speak to him. <laughs> oh. So, are you fairly happy with the offer, Anthony? Well, I'm sorry to see my skittles go, but yeah. they'll go to a better home, I'm sure. Yeah.
Have we got the deal? Yes, I've got the deal. Thank you very much. And enjoy cleaning it. Oh, yeah, <laughs> thanks for cleaning. <laughs> and uh, what did you do to me? Karen, you've got some cleaning to do. What a charmer. Thank you. <laughs> With another camera.